In an interview with Tucker Carlson on Fox News, Sansara Taylor warned America that President Donald Trump was a fascist, a Nazi, more dangerous than Hitler. During her raving rant, Ms. Taylor explained, We're facing an emergency. Humanity is facing an emergency. A fascist regime has seized the reins of power. Trump and Pence are operating out of Hitler's playbook, only they have nuclear weapons. Her unhinged diatribe was clear. Your freedom and your very lives are in danger as a result of the Trump presidency. But just who is Sansara Taylor? And could she possibly be the queen of duplicity? Especially on the point that it is Donald Trump who poses a threat to your life and freedom. Searching her bio on the net, you'll read that she is an activist, author, speaker, stages freedom rides, hates religion, fights against patriarchy, pro-abortionist, blah blah blah. But the primary accomplishment most often mentioned is that she is a writer for Revolution Newspaper. What is Revolution Newspaper, you ask? Well, you can find them at revcom.us. And yes, you guessed it. They are full-fledged crimson red hammer and sickle communist. In fact, they proudly refer to themselves with the tagline, the voice of the revolutionary communist party USA. This political party is regarded as the largest Maoist party in the US. Now if you know your history, this is where things get a little comical, if not downright hypocritical. First, there isn't a shred of reputable or even disreputable evidence to show Donald Trump or Mike Pence are fascist, let alone Hitler-loving Nazis. This type of rhetoric employed by the loony left, in this case the true left, a communist, is simply used to demonize political opponents. Repeat a lie often enough and weaker people will believe it's the truth. Second, for a communist to warn anybody about the murderous ways of a Nazi? is akin to a serial killer complaining about a suicide bomber. You remember the communists, don't you? The political philosophy that gave us Stalin, Mao, Castro, and Pol Pot, just to name a few? Surely you recall that communism is the totalitarian oppressive system responsible for the murders of between 85 and 100 million men, women, and children during the 20th century. Ring any bells yet? The Soviet Union? The Cold War, the Iron Curtain, the Berlin Wall, North Korea, China, Vietnam, the Khmer Rouge. While Psycho Sansara Taylor sounds the alarm in her conspiratorial make-believe world finding a demon behind every free market capitalist, her own political philosophy and its heroes have real dead bodies stacked up like cordwood. In fact, her hero, Chairman Mao, is considered the greatest mass murderer in history. Seriously, her charges against Donald Trump and Mike Pence might be laughable if it weren't so sad.